Cash in the blow the brains. Cash in the blow the brain. Got cash on a private plane. Hey, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Nigel No TV, and today I'm back with a new banger, banger video. You know what I'm saying? I got a surprise for y'all today. We are doing Gonna Wanna Dreadlock Transformation. Yes, I said it. We are doing his dreadlock journey today. And uh, hey, do your boy a favor. Share the channel with your cousin, grandma, sister, everybody you know. Like, real talk. Even the little kid down the street that you don't like. Share the channel with that little nigga. Real talk. And without further ado, I want y'all to like comment and subscribe to your boy real talk Sh subscribe hit that button real deal i need that i need it but let's go ahead and get into the video so as y'all niggas can see pete game this is gonna want in 2016 yes i said it my nigga it's gonna in 2016 real talk so as y'all can see this is gonna with a small afro you know what i'm saying Look like he trying to freeform and shit. Like he look like he been sponging and he got the little needles and shit spiking up. He using the tire rub. It, either or it works. But as you can see, he trying to get into the dreadlock game, obviously. And um hey, it look like he got four C, four B health. So hey, you want dreads like gunners in that range. So make sure your hair is like in the four type category. You gotta have like tightly curled hair. So let's go ahead and go to the next one. Right here, y'all, as y'all can see, this is Ghana in 2017. And as you can see, his dreadlocks are looking pretty damn sharp. You got the little noodles, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, he looking fresh to the dreadlock game right now. And at this point, you can most definitely tell my nigga freeformed his dreads a little bit. You don't really see anything tightly done to this nigga scalp at all. Like, nothing is tight to his scalp. And basically, you know... His dreads are looking loosely formed. And you know, basically he in the baby stages. So no more afro in the building. It's dread head gunner. Baby dread gunner. So at this point, he most definitely used the sponge and towel method. You can also see that he bleached his hair at the end. So he got a little bleached highlights and stuff. And another thing, for my bros and my females, you know what I'm saying? When you're using the dread sponge, try not to go in, go in too hard with the dread sponge because, like, you'll pull some hair out, you'll damage your shit. So, don't be too rough with it. Just lightly go over it with some product or whatever you want to use with it and just take care of it. All right? Do that for me. So, all right, y'all. This is Gunner in 2018. So, yeah, my nigga hit his two year mark with his dreadlock. So, in this year, you see Gunner rocking the fishtail braids more often than usual. You know, he's trying to keep his hair maintained and stuff like that. So, yeah, it ain't no surprise that Gunner got his own personal dread style. You know, you see Lil Wayne, Sway Lee, Lil Dirk, and 2 Chains, for example. You know, they all been rocking the dreadlock braids and stuff for a while. So, it ain't no surprise that he got it. You know what I'm saying? His locks going crazy. So as you can see, he went back to his black color with his dread. So it ain't no more dying that bit. You know what I'm saying? He ain't damaging his hair. But I'll let you know this though. That style he got, that dreadlock style, I, I fuck with it because most definitely because how he got it braided and he'll let that let his little ends at the back hang. And another thing that I have to let y'all niggas know, when you get your hair braided to the back like that, I'm telling you this because I love y'all. When you get your hair braided back like that, this is for my bros. Yeah, women good. Now, nah, but the niggas, your hairline will get pushed back, my nigga. You will be walking around this hole looking like LeBron James and Mark Henry with a fat ass forehead. Real talk. He ain't lying. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna tell you the truth. So, hey, I'm just keeping it real. So yeah, that that's gonna in 2018 with his dreadlocks. His shit fire. So, hey, y'all, uh, right here, man, we got Gunner in 2019. Yes, sir, man, we got 2019 Gunner Wanna in the building. So, at this point, Gunner done went and bleached his whole damn head, bro. He done bleached this shit, bro. This shit fried. Now, let me quit playing, but, man, look, Sun ain't doing enough to, like, make it platinum blonde or anything, like how you see Young Thug and Future wearing they shit, but... It's like, like what he did to achieve that look he got right there. He kept his bleach less, like he kept it in less than what you normally would do to achieve that bronze orange kind of look. And you know he been maintaining his dreads a lot though. This shit look dope. He has crinkled dreads in this video right here. If you didn't know, and if you want to get crinkled dreads, man, 
go ahead and get your shit braided and keep it enough for a long period of time and watch how that shit just look all wavy and shit like the ocean like real talk but hey this shit dope it look dope and you can tell he don't hit that three year mark in it with his dreads man this shit by his chin like real talk he can put that shit in his mouth if he wanted to but man hey this is gonna in his three year mark man this shit, this shit hard niggas can tell man this is gonna in 2019 once again i just thought it was a dope as i did to show y'all what his dress looked like with the braid locks in 2019 so as you can tell this is gonna's go-to dress style at this point like it's just obvious like you can just tell this is nigga go-to dress style he gets it a lot you know what i'm saying so i just thought it was nice for me to give y'all a little bit of advice you know what i'm saying Find y'all a dread style that works for you, that looks good on your head. If you got a little ass head, find you a dread style that look good on your little ass head. You know what I'm saying? If you got a big ass head, find a dread style that look good on your size XL fucking head. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, as you can tell, Gunner got a buff ass head, so he get his dreads braided to the back. I'm going to tell you another thing. When you get your hair braided, it promotes a whole bunch of hair growth. You know what I'm saying? A whole bunch of hair growth. It increases the blood flow in your head. So, yeah. I just thought it was nice for me to tell y'all that. And this is Gunna with his braid locks in 2019. Sorry, child. This is Gunna in 2020. So, check this out. Man, my guy over here getting his hair retwisted in the video. And, you know, he also wearing a different dread style. He got his dreads and two strand twists which is a different look from what he usually get with the fishtail braids you know what i'm saying but now that you think about it man it's actually kind of rare to see him without the fishtail braids even though that's how he maintain his hair and keep it in braids and stuff like this this is actually a different kind of style he used to maintain it you know so in 2020 you start seeing him more with his hair down and with the two strand twist you know it's actually good to let your hair breathe when you let it down everywhere once in a while you know you gotta let it breathe catch some air you know what i'm saying so i guess he switched it up because he got tired of the fishtail braids going to the back and that was putting wear and tear on his scalp like real talk like when you get it braided back you know it push your hairline back like i stated earlier but he also dyed his hair completely bronze again and man, that's scary to me because from what I heard, like, man, you dye your roots and shit like that, it actually slows your hair growth down from what I heard. But other than that, man, I like the style he got going on with his dreads, just especially because two strand twist is my go-to dread style. It's easy for me. But yeah, this gun in 2020. Working. You and me, I got you, that's for certain. Sorry, child. This is gonna in 2021. Yes, this is him in present time. This is him in the right now. You know what I'm saying? So he dished the bronze look. He ain't rocking the orange bronze hair color no more. He got the regular bronze color going on. Unless the bronze don't fade it. And you know it happens to everybody. Your hair is gonna fade. The dye is gonna fade out. And as you can see, he got the barrel twist plaits going on. And you know I'm digging the look. Gunna came a long way from the small ass afro to all the way up to now. And from 2016 to 2021, man, this nigga been going crazy with his dreads. He been taking care of his shit. But let's go ahead and get into it, y'all. So if y'all want dreads like Gunna, man, start out from an afro, then sponge that shit, get free foreign dreads, let it do his own thing, and then wait for it to lock. And then start getting it retwisted and maintained and keep it in braid styles. It's very similar to Polo G dreads, man. And that's all y'all got to do, y'all. And I'm out. Can we relate? Ooh, yeah. Can we debate? Ooh, yeah. But I want debate.